Hi guys, it's Angie with Itty Bitty Crafts and today is a haul for Crafty Me Shop. Um, it is located on Facebook and YouTube, but if you go on Facebook and look up Crafty Me Shop and join the group, you'll be able to get on, on in on, on the sales that happen every Friday. And um, it's owned by Esme and she sells laces, trims, bling, um, trinket boxes, um, candy boxes that are full of all kinds of good stuff um, but anyways I wanted to come and show you what I had purchased the last couple of Fridays and all the fun stuff because uh, she just sells the most different fun one-of-a-kind items but anyways so um, one of my purchases was uh, some trim and some little trinkets sorry for the crinkling but I kind of wanted to open this with you guys so I didn't want to take everything out. So this is a really pretty, you know, dainty trim, kind of like a tassel. Um, super cool. I love the, the natural color of it, the neutral. Anyways, there's one trim that I got. And this one, oh my gosh, I love this. It's so whimsical. And that's what I kind of love about her store. I'm a kind of a whimsical artist. Um, I actually just did a project share for her, her, uh, guest design team that I'm on. And this is what I just, uh, made for her, for her design team. But anyways, I just love her trims. It's like super whimsical and I just love this, this kind of confetti look trim. So there's that one. And then I got some little rosettes, sorry for the glare, with pearls on it. We'll just leave those ones in the bag <laughs> and then we'll take these ones out here was like a little charms I guess these are more like charms so she sells really cool charms and these little hearts kind of like have they're kind of like a like a bell they're like my favorite kind of sound they're like I don't know how to explain it <laughs> but anyways so I got um two bags of those and her prices are very reasonable um so Anyways, and then I purchased two of these. Look how fun those are. Lots of things you can do with those. And then um, these are um, some chipboard. This one's a house. How fun is that going to be to put together? I just love how it's country cottage kind of a look and I like everybody knows from my channel I build little houses so houses are a kind of a thing for me and this one I got um, with some fairies and this is chipboard as well and during that purchase I mean Esme is just so super sweet she'll surprisingly throw things in here and there and this was one things that she threw in there it's just kind of like her appreciation for her for her sales and she's just super sweet so I haven't seen what was in here yet I kind of waited till we could all go through it together um, I know everybody doesn't like crinkling noises so so sorry there we go I'll try to be as quiet as I can oh my gosh look at these Wow, thank you, Esme, for doing that. It's so super sweet of you. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at these. Isn't that beautiful? Love that. And then, oh my gosh, look at this. So pretty. Oh my gosh, thank you. I absolutely love this, too. So pretty, you guys. And she works really hard to get, you know, trims that are, you know, French trims and Italian trims. I mean, she just really super goes out of her way to find all this awesome stuff. And so this is my latest purchase and this little bag of goodies. I just love the way she sends her items. I mean, she's just so, she's just so awesome. Just love you, Esme. Anyway, this cute little bag. And they smell so good. It smells like roses, like a bag of roses. I love the smell of roses. Look at this, you guys. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I just look at that. How could you say no to this? 
I don't know. I I don't even know what my favorite color is anymore. I used to kind of like like blue or like a Indian teal, um, but this is just so striking. I mean, just beautiful. Um, can't wait to do something with this. And then I got some ruffle tool, which we all love that. Very whimsical, obviously, my style. And then um, a little rosette, which I've been really into uh, making like rosette collages, kind of. Um, something like um, this right here. And so they've been a lot of fun to make. And so um, I will sometimes cut this apart and use this as a main flower or reconstruct it. But isn't that just a beautiful color? It's kind of like a coral. And then this dainty little trim, of course. Very very beautiful um, just I love itty bitty stuff and I'm just really you know drawn to the little the little details in some of these trims and laces and then of course I had to get some pom-pom tool trim <laughs> I don't know what I'll do but I just loved it because it was whimsy um, maybe I'll make a another doll um, with maybe like a you know skirt or something or a even like, you know, you could do a collar or you could do, there's so many possibilities with this. I just love this trim. It's so fun. I love that. And then my favorite things are the trinket boxes. Um, I, this is the things that draw me into her shop are just, um, let me get this open really quick. her trinket boxes. I was able and lucky enough to get two. <laughs> um, when she says she's going to have trinket, trinket boxes, I, I will sit there patiently waiting until she posts them so I can try to get them because I love them. They're so fun. And, um, you know, there's so, there's like, you know, all kinds of fun stuff in here. Um, let's go through this really quick. So this is one box that I got. So there's some um, trim and a uh, clothespin and some doily lace. Oh, that's really pretty. So this is the first time I'm seeing this stuff. Like I said, it reminds me like of a really cool junk drawer, <laughs> but just like with really awesome stuff in it. Little swatch and looks like um, some like glass glitter. Isn't that really pretty? And some bling. It's just fun to go through these. Look at how vintage that is. You can tell that's vintage. You know. And some cool vintage buttons and appliques. Oh my gosh, look at those old buttons in there. And they're put together so cute. Look at that trim. Wrapped around a spool with that awesome rusty pin. And then just a, like a little tag with a pin on it. And some beaded flowers. And some really cool, wow, these are like metal or something, or like the backing, it's really neat. Look at that. Those are really cool. It's like, they feel like glass. Interesting. And look at this little tiny jar full of just stuff. Little seed beads. Oh, a little cute little heart in there. And then a little rosette. And like I told Esme, I don't even know how she gets rid of, like, how she sells. <laughs> like, I would want to keep them all. And then just topped off, you know, the bottom with a bunch of ephemera. Oh, look at the button. See, there's just, like, all kinds of fun stuff in here, you guys. Um, Look at the ephemera we got in here. So fun. Bingo cards. And just some ephemera. Very cool ephemera, though. Um, very cool. And some Tim Holtz peoples. A little chipboard crown and some tags. And some more ephemera. Anyway, just really neat stuff. I just doily, paper doily, just adore 
adore the trinket boxes and they do go fast so i have to have like quick hands like get your thumbs ready like esme says but anyways i'll put that back nice and neat you don't need to waste time on it so here's trinket box number two and this is really cool tape it's like fabric fabric tape that's pretty cool this is box number two and like i said every trinket box is different has a little bit of different stuff in it again a tag and more of these i don't know they're like glass they're really cool some um, ribbon some more of those and these are these are glass as well and a button and some more little trinkets in here as you can see very fun sequence and and then um, some more and you can tell those are vintage buttons little thing of vintage buttons and rolled roses look at that button in there that's really cool and that and then this is really cool look at an old pit clothes pin with some lace wrapped around it I love that I started um, you know I don't have any of these I have <laughs> I have sticks and cinnamon sticks and down here and all that kind of stuff. So that's what I wrap mine around with when I give out little uh, gifts. But look at more glass glitter. I think this is German glass glitter. I love this stuff. It's super amazing. Oh, wow. Look at these cute swatches. And then it has like a little piece of bling to hold it on. Very cute. Oh, look at this. I think it's a hanky. Vintage hanky. Get some tags and a heart and some more ephemera a little card and then we'll just flip through this ephemera really quick oh very pretty tags more ephemera that's a cool chair um little receipt looking things bingo cards swatches um scrap paper which is very pretty color actually I love this color it's very pretty pink some scrapbook paper very fun so very happy with this I love like I said their trinket boxes are so fun so different and uh, I'll go get that later um, who isn't a sucker for trinket boxes right and then I was just so floored because I was like, that's all I ordered, right? And she sent me uh, the kindness of her heart. Oh my gosh, Esme. I, um, this is kind of happy mail from Esme. Um, so I wanted to share that with you. She sent this to me for Valentine's. And I was so, I don't know. I just, I love you, Esme. Thank you for being just so generous so kind so giving um you treat everybody with kindness you're just you're such a dear heart and i i'm so blessed that i got to meet you and got to know you and we become really good friends and we laugh together a lot you're just you're just you're just a you're just so fun and thank you for sending me this you didn't have to but you just that's just who you are and I love it. And so anyway, she made me this Valentine's card. Just look at her beautiful work. She is so talented. And her, her family is super talented. Her sister is this amazing pastry artist who makes these amazing um, cookies and pastries. And I plan on buying them for birthday gifts. Um, you'll have to go. Uh, I'll actually put her sister's Facebook link down below so you can check out her sister's cookies because they are amazing. But uh, Esme is just out of this world talented, and she's just so whimsy like me, and she loves that whimsical kind of look. But anyways, this is a mixed media tag, and she has like a little puff heart here, and it's, it's just so cute in the cardboard, and it's, love it. And she says, happy Valentine's Day. Love you, Esme. Thank you so much, Esme. I actually love this same writing, too. <laughs> so pretty. Oh, I love it. I can't wait to put it up. And then look at all she got me, guys. A die-cut house. Are you kidding me? Seriously? 
I cannot wait to uh, cut this out and maybe like put trim on it or something, right? Thank you so much. That is just, just so kind of you. And then she sent me this also for Valentine's Day. Oh my gosh, thank you. <laughs> I know, I'm weird. Look at these little itty bitty doves. I believe those are doves. There's a handful in here. And look at the little bling. The little tiny applique. So cute. And I love this little itty bitty tart tin. So adorable. I used to put these upside down and do clown heads on top of them. And this would kind of be their collar. That would be really cute, huh? So super cute. And then, oh my gosh, look at this collar, you guys. It's so pretty. And then a rolled rose. Can't go wrong on those. It's so pretty. Look at that. Love it. And some more of this awesome trim. Very pretty. Very vintage. Love the color. They're so subtle. Love that. And a little pretty heart. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Just love it. Just little fur pom-poms on some leather. Oh my gosh, I love those. Look how pretty that is. Very vintage. Oh my gosh, Esme, thank you. Oh my gosh, oh, I love this. Look at how pretty that flower is. And another applique. And oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, I might take a cast of that. Look how, that is totally vintage. Oh my gosh, I love this. I need to cast more of these, I think. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I'm going to be able to. Oh my gosh, look at that. Super pretty. And some bling. And some bigger doves. How fun. And some more little doves. And some little roses. Oh my gosh. And she put a little, like, um, you know, shreds. But anyways, um... She, Thank you so much, Esme. Like, honestly, seriously, from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much. You make, you make life so much fun. Seriously. You make everything so much fun. And I couldn't be more blessed to be a part of your friendship and, um, you know, your shop and you giving me the opportunity to be a part of your, your team forever. How long, you know, I just appreciate that you, that you thought of me and, and that, um, you know, you're just super silly and super fun to be with and talk to. But um, anyways, this is just a little haul that I wanted to do. I know it's kind of a big haul. <laughs> but I just wanted you to see the cool stuff that she sells and how excited it makes me. Because I, I love to go through it with you because it's you can hear my excitement. You can't really see my face, obviously. But you can hear the excitement in my voice, how, how fun her shop is and how how dedicated she is to her, you know, um, the people who buy things from her. She, she's just an awesome lady. So anyways, again, that is uh, crafty me shop on Facebook and then crafty me shop on YouTube. And I will have links below. Um, so I just wanted to thank everybody for sticking this video through for, uh, almost 20, 20 minutes. Oh my gosh, uh, with me and uh, thank you for making it to the end. I super appreciate every one of you. Um, it's been a joy being on YouTube and getting to share our talents and seeing everybody's talents. But anyways, everybody have a lovely evening, morning, and day. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.